Okay, so hopefully you've been having some fun having a look at uh, trying to solve some of these. This one on the left hand side is meant to be relatively straightforward because we've got three resistors, but they're identical resistors in parallel. So the total resistance should be a third. We can work out the total resistance there should be 20 ohms. This is a sixth of that, 10 ohms and a third of that. So it's 20 ohms. So the total resistance of this lot should be 50 ohms and you can actually build these and you know and it, it works and it works pretty well this one over here is definitely trickier okay and I'm going to give you a series of hints and if you want to you can pause the video and see if you can then solve it after you've got the hint before I tell you the final solution so the first hint is that this thing has rotational symmetry and knowing that will help you solve it. Okay, pause the video, see if that's helped. Okay, did it help? Perhaps it did, perhaps not. Let me show you what I mean by the fact that it's got rotational symmetry. So obviously coming in, kind of these, these bits are all connected, but, you know, and over here, these bits are all connected. But if we rotate it around here, we can see this, vertex is the same as this one is the same as this one so let's let's draw that in now so these are all the same these are all the same these are all the same so those three are the same and similarly coming in this direction these ones are the same these ones are the same and these ones are the same see if that helps you kind of redraw it and, and figure out what's going on okay did that help maybe it did maybe not but let's have a look now so we've got three resistors of 60 ohms going between purple and green how many resistors have we then got going from green to red we've got one two three four five six so we have three resistors in parallel then we've got six resistors in parallel and then going from red to turquoise we've got one two three hang on a minute that's basically what we drew over here we've got three resistors coming in on purple going from purple to green then we've got six resistors going from green to red and then we've got uh three resistors going from red to turquoise so the very surprising result is that this is an identical layout to this and the answer is just 50 ohms okay we've relied on a bit of a bit of a trick but it works well now if you liked that problem and some of you will have loved that problem i i really like that problem then you want to try your new skills what about this so instead of thinking about it from being opposite vertices what about if the it was connected from here to here what would happen in that situation or what would happen if you connected it from here to here so what are the total resistances in either of those examples and some of the same techniques will work um, and will help you answer them but I'm not going to give you the answers so it's a, some problems for you to work on uh, either now or at home Thank you very much.